Hello everybody and thank you for tuning in to 1111 Synchronicity Tarot. I am back with another reading. So let's hop straight into it, okay? Now I already shuffled the deck and I already put some cards out here. Got some energy out here, y'all, okay? And first cards out, we got the Ten of Cups, we got the Empress, and we got the Ace of Swords and the Six of Wands here, okay, y'all? So, just let me know. Y'all getting ready to have a, 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 a happy family, okay? God is getting ready to bless you all with a beautiful family of your own here, okay? And I feel like it's been long overdue, Empress, here, okay? I feel like you've been doing everything right. Now, if you all have not been celibate, you know what I'm saying? Or maybe you can just be practicing abstinence or something like that, y'all, okay? But I am strongly getting a lot of you all are celibate. Like, you all have been doing good by yourselves you have been focusing on your work here your career your home life your health self-care uh and like i said your uh you know your overall well-being here okay loving yourself here giving yourself love self-love here okay making sure you're whole here okay birthing new ideas like this is the energy that you're in here you're in this empress energy here and god is getting ready to bless you with the family empress and some of you all you know the empress um is like a mother she births okay so like you all can literally be getting ready to have a child here okay you could be getting ready to have a child with with whoever God is getting ready to send it to your life here. All right. And spirit is saying that is the absolute truth. All right. This is what's getting ready to happen. Okay. In 2024, I'm seeing a lot of you all are getting ready to get engaged. You all are definitely getting ready to have a, a child or um it, that's if you're in the childbearing age y'all okay if you're in a childbearing age you're in good health and things like that okay i definitely see a child being born with whoever god is getting ready to bring into your life here okay and then we got the six of one so i said that you all are birthing new ideas you all are focusing on your career here okay so some of you all could have just had like a come up or something okay like you're doing amazing in your life here okay and a lot of people it's like a lot of people are witnessing this greatness here okay i feel like some of you all could have started something okay from nothing and now it's huge like it has blown up y'all okay it's huge all right and and i feel like for some of y'all it's something wrapped around your intuition here okay so you all could have started a spiritual business you can have like a platform like me all right you all can have like a uh y'all i'm seeing like palmistry Okay, like a shop, like you all might have a shop or something like that. Or you might sell candles, incense, oils, things like that. If it's not a spiritual business, it's some type of business you started here. I'm even getting y'all real estate, like those people that buy houses and flip them. Real estate, you could you could like cry leak, cry leak or something like that, y'all. Is that yeah, cry leak. Um, and I'm also getting like some of you all can be flipping houses or something like you can buy houses and then remodel them and like sell them or rent them out or something like that. Some of y'all either getting ready to do that. Okay. Or that's something that you're doing now. All right. Yeah. Now I feel like in the past job, I feel like you all dealt with somebody here that could have been a player. All right. You dealt with somebody that could have been a player, all right? This is somebody that, you know, wanted to keep their options open. This is somebody that, you know, dated around. They give you a little bit of their time. And the, and, the, and the time that I feel like this person could have gave you, y'all had a good time, an amazing time. Because this energy, dude, they're young. They're very passionate, okay? They, they... You know, they, 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 they take care of you when it comes to, you know, what, what I mean. Okay. So they going to do that. It's just that they going to scoop, scoop, scoop. They going to get up out of there though. Okay. It's like, y'all going to have a real good passionate time. All right. Uh, uh, nightcap and all that. But when it comes to this person, oh, here, oh, this person, it's like he, he, your person or this person, I'm not even going to say your person. I'm going to say this particular energy right here. It's like they were non-committal. Okay, they were non-committal. They had plenty of women maybe that they dealt with and things like that. But now you got the player, this person here that was 
inconsistent, non-committal. Now you got it to where this person, now they want to come in and they want to put the work in towards this connection, okay? So if in the past this person did not give you commitment, they were in and out hot and cold, you never knew where you stood with this person, they didn't open up to you, or if you knew this person was skinning and grinning in different people's faces and things like that, okay? Now you got this person wanting to come in and put the work in towards this connection here with you. Okay, you want this, you got this person that's actually willing to come in being faithful, doing what it, what it takes to win you over and get you and not only just get you, but keep you here. Okay, because you can, you can get somebody, but can you keep them? Can you do what it takes to keep them? You can, you can get somebody, but can you keep them? So this person here is finna put the work in to not only get you, but keep you here. Okay, so that means that this person has definitely worked on themselves here, okay? They have worked on themselves. This person is realizing that maybe it ain't nobody else out here like you because look at the energy that you're in. You're in this Empress energy and you're also in this Six of Wands energy here, okay? So it's like you're every queen in, in the deck here, all right? So you're doing extremely well right now, Empress. Like you're doing amazing. And I keep hearing it like you're amazing, okay? And I feel like this person is watching you. Whatever it is that you're doing, this person is watching you here, okay? But I feel like not only this person, a lot of people is, like, watching you. Like, people could have, like, seen you maybe when you, before you got into this energy. And maybe they seen you elevate or something like that, y'all, okay? It's what I'm getting here, okay? And you got, you got a lot of people that I feel like that love you, love watching you here, okay? And people can also be inspired. People can actually be learning from you as well. Even your haters, y'all, even if you have people that's jealous and envious of you, they're inspired by you too here, okay? They are, believe it or not here, okay? But you, you could have had people that was competing with you for this person. But let me just tell you something collective this per these people were competing with you when this person was in a low vibration when they were in this player energy all right i feel like you knew who you were okay you knew that you were you were this empress here okay you knew what you deserved here all right and you knew your worth because you're somebody here that love yourself here okay and it's like you're like you know what i'm not in no competition because one thing about it, I can't keep no man that don't want to be kept. So I feel like that's the energy that you in. you like, you know what? If y'all want to compete for him, then you go ahead. Y'all go ahead on and do that. But I'm finna sit on over here on my throne and I'm not finna move from this motherfucker. I'm not finna move from my throne. I'm not finna get up. You hear me? Because him being a man, if he want me, he gonna come pursue me. All right, and he gonna put the work in and he gonna do what it takes to get me and keep me. I don't have to get off this throne. I know my worth. You know what I'm saying? I know my worth and I feel like that's the energy that you was in. You like compete with who? Some of y'all was in a competition and you didn't even know you was in a competition. People were putting you in a competition, y'all, that you had nothing, you, you knew nothing about. Okay, so this person maybe mentioned you to some people. All right. Or these people was lurking. Maybe you come in and on something or they found that about you. I don't know. But you had people that was trying to compete for a spot in this masculine life when he was in this energy. He wasn't committed to nobody. I don't care if he, he, he got a piece of ass from him. That's all they got. You see what I'm saying? But because confirmation, y'all heard that. But because you were in this energy, guess what? You are the one that stood out from the rest. It's like they was trying to win at all costs. And they was just trying to get with them when they could. But he was in a low vibration. He was in a player energy. Yeah, you could be the main one that someone is effing. But at the end of the day, do this man see you as his wife? Do he see you as somebody that he can grow old with? You know what I'm saying? Like, can he see you as that? You get what I'm saying? And I feel like it, even if this person gave somebody an offer, he was not faithful. Let's just, let's, let's keep it a buck. He was not. All right. So these people mad at you in competition with you over this man. When you was, this, this was you, you was focused on your own shit. That's why you're in the six of ones energy. That's why you're successful. All right. 
that's why you're successful that's why you got a thriving business or you have came up like your money up you all could have just got a new car a new house or or you all could have just moved to a new city and state or something like that but things are going really well for you because you mind your business and look baby people are noticing you here okay yeah because look now you're the queen of pentacles okay you put the work in on yourself here okay and now you're the queen of pentacles here all right yes 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 you are all right and not only is people watching you but you got this person right here from your past right here that didn't want to commit to you in the past that now wants to come put this work in and they like the co who who in competition it ain't no competition when it comes to this woman see you're the empress but the, the the queen that sticks out the most for you right now is this queen of pentacles. You're the woman with the coin here, okay? You got your mind on your money and your money on your mind. You hear me, okay? And this person is seeing it and it's actually turning this person on here, okay? Yeah, you all, you all just got, I don't know, people can look at you as lucky, all right? Because it's like everything that you have manifested, everything that you said that you was going to do, you're doing it. All right. So maybe whatever it is that you're doing could have been an idea at one time. Maybe you didn't have whatever this is off the ground just yet. And people could have judged you during your journey when you was trying to get to this point here. OK, when you was trying to get to this point and now you're there because something turned around for you here. OK, something was fated for you to happen. See, collective, it was fated for you to be rich. It was fated for you to have a, 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 a luxurious lifestyle here. It was not meant for you to struggle here. Yeah, you could have had to go through things here, okay? So you could be humble. So you can know how to uh, take care of the blessings that God giving you, all right? God had to make sure that he did put you through certain lessons so you could be humble and do right when you got this blessing or enter into a certain tax bracket here, okay? You know what I'm saying? Okay, you got judgment here, okay? Y'all, I feel like with this judgment card, these people that was in secret competition with you, and I feel like these people could have lied on you and did certain things to you, y'all, because the five of wands is doing any and everything at all costs to win, okay? Yes, all right? They definitely do. They'll do anything underhandedly to get what it is that they want, and they don't stop. So whoever these people were in your divine masculine's life, did any and everything to try to stop you and try to stop y'all from coming together here, okay? And like I said, I feel like it was lies and manipulation, y'all, okay? Definitely heavy manipulation here, all right? But these people are getting ready to receive judgment. And you're you're just sitting here on your throne, baby, okay? And look at you. You're getting good luck here. These people finna receive heavy karma here. Okay, yeah, look, this person looking at you as their queen of cups here. So this person is sitting right now. I feel like they're thinking about marrying you, like marriage, the home life. Okay, because the overall energy here, y'all, was the ten of cups for this reading. The overall energy was the ten of cups. Your divine masculine want to come in now and want to give you a commitment. Okay, but this person, like I said, they're not, they're not coming in to just get you. Okay, this person is coming in to get you and keep you. This person wants something long term with you. This person wants a family with you. They look at you as their wife here. And I don't feel like this person want to settle down with nobody else but you. Okay, they don't look at now one of these options or now one of these people they could have been screwing or any of that as their wife. Somebody that they really want to give their heart to and be committed to forever. And just, I'm talking about one woman. This man right here could have even been in relationships before. Could have been with people before. But I don't feel like this man has ever been with one woman in his whole life. Like, I feel like it's always been side pieces. It might have been a main one. Okay? But I don't, I don't feel like he's ever had just one. Okay? And I feel like... This is something new. Wait, this is something new that he's doing here, okay, with you. You're going to be his one and only, not his main one. Because I don't want to be the main one and, and, and it's three, four, five more other ones that's claiming him or can get up on that thing. You know what I'm saying? This man here is going to claim you and you're going to be his one and only here. All right? Yeah, this person is watching you be single, self-sufficient, a whole boss. Some of you all, like I said, can be in... um. Uh, you all can uh, be in like the entrepreneur, entrepreneurial 
world here okay so definitely you all could have just started a business and it's doing really really well you all could have definitely came into some unexpected money as well here and like i said not only are these people here that were secret secretly competing with you watching you here stalking you some of these people were stalking you some of these people pull up your social media every single day if you have an online business, an online presence, these people pull up your social media every single day. They get up and they type your name in. They get up and they go see what you're doing, okay? Because these people, I feel like, are obsessed with you, with what you're doing, all right? And these could be haters too, but they're obsessed with what you're doing and they're obsessed with you and your divine masculine here okay so i feel like they could be watching him as well trying to see if something is going to come together trying to see if if some of y'all they they watch tarot readings to see if this person is going to come back to you some of them start because i'm hearing a new line of study some of them might have if you're spiritual some of these people got into spirituality or start doing little stuff to be nosy to see if this person coming back to you, all right, are y'all going to get married? Like, what's going on? It's like they trying to get the scoop on you and this man here, okay? But I feel like God is only giving these people so much information here, okay? I don't care if, if they do tarot. I don't care if they got a pendulum. I don't care if they doing those what those spells uh, that, that, what's that, the, the, the subconscious mind or something where they, like, it's like a truth something spell. I don't know. Whatever they, it is that they're doing, they're still not getting everything. God is not going to give these people all the answers. Now, they may be able to pry a little bit, but they're, God is not going to give these people all the information that they need to know when it comes to you and your divine masculine. Because I feel like you all's union is highly protected. You know what I'm saying? Like he's not going to tell these people or give these people any information here. Okay, they might they might know that this is your divine masculine. They might know y'all meant to be together, but far as when it's coming together, the exact time, um, whatever, they don't know any of that here. Okay, which is why they're watching you and spying on you because they don't know. Like they seriously don't know. I don't care what they do in divination, how they misuse it, what they do, they not gonna know God's plans. You know what I'm saying to these people here. Okay, but your person is watching you as well. But I feel like after all this spying, prying, lying, manipulation that these people did, look at them. They're still defeated. All right. And some of them here, they did illegal things to spy on you here. Some of them could have actually harassed you. Some of them could have been coming, going past your home, y'all. Okay. They could have had people illegally watching you like if your person was a celebrity or is a celebrity or they have a whole lot of uh motion in y'all community or town or something like that it was people that was stalking you these people could have hired private investigators could have lied and said that you were doing something to have people follow you and it wasn't because you did anything to them it was because they just wanted to see was you and this man dealing with each other, y'all. People could have did false reports to have people illegally spy on you and watch you. They lie on you. And it was all because of this man making sure that y'all don't come together. Making sure he ain't with you and you ain't with him, y'all. Okay? It was some for some of y'all they did this. And so some of y'all it's it's gonna go to court here what these people did. And some of them finna get public shame and dishonor. Okay? Public shame and dishonor here. All right. Yeah, but you got this person here, okay, that's getting ready to move towards you here, okay? I feel like this person here has, like, the courage to come towards you here, okay, and and speak their truth and, and pour out their heart and let you know, you know, like, what they really want from you here, all right? Because this person is missing you. This person don't want to be away from you any longer here, all right? This person is, is definitely, I feel like, at night is when it hits this person the most. I feel like they're thinking about you um uh, every day all day i just feel like at nighttime when this person is getting ready to like go to sleep and things like that i feel like they think about you a whole lot here okay and they definitely ace of wands they want a new beginning with you i like a new passionate beginning here with you okay and this is what they're getting ready to come in here and tell you 
what they want here. They're finna get ready to speak their truth here. Okay, but just know they're watching you. If you have YouTube like me, or like I said, your your business popping, you you know, you 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 out there doing your thing online, okay, whether that's Facebook, TikTok, uh, Instagram, X, whatever that is, uh, they watching you. This person is watching you. You might not even know that they're watching you, but they are here. You might intuitively know that this person watching you, but they 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 are. If you if you had if you had an inkling like wow, I don't know why I feel like my person is watching me some way or keeping up with me cuz they are. They're watching you, okay? Cuz this person is missing you and they're and they're they're getting the courage to come towards you and tell you that they want a a commitment. All right, spirit, give me some more here. Uh on the collective person that's wanting to return here. Yeah, look. Will I see you again? When will I see you again? Y'all, ain't this baby face? That's the song I just heard. This person want to know, when will I see you again? So you could be hearing from this person. They could be sending you a message like, hey, how you doing? They could start off small and then it gradually work. You know, I'm telling you, look. When will I see you again? And look, I need to see you. Like this person want to see you. They don't, they don't want to be away from you no more. I'm telling you. Okay, look, it says, I want to man up and honor you. Like this person want to honor you. I'm here. I want to worship the ground. You walk on, baby. You hear me? Look, I want the world to know that you're mine. Okay, look at that. I'm telling you, y'all, I want to honor you. This person said they want to honor you here. Okay, look, can we work it out? Can y'all work it out, collector? When this person come in towards you, can y'all work it out? Because... You need to be figuring out what you want. He like, can we work it out? He want to work it out with you. He want to apologize. You know, how inconsistent he was in the past, the way he moved, you know, in this player energy, not giving you the commitment that you, you, he knew that you deserved. Because I feel like this person here knew you deserved it. They just wasn't ready. They, they, they was caught up in that lifestyle. You know what I'm saying? Pimping. They were pimping, pimping. Okay, space, what, what's that? Space age pimping. Okay, some of y'all might be from Memphis, Tennessee, Tennessee. Our white space age pimping. But from the South, y'all could be from the South. You don't have to be, but I just pick up strong South energy. Yeah. Say we gotta work it out. Say we gonna work it out. You fill me up with happiness. Yeah, you complete this person. You make them happy, baby. All right, you make this person, y'all. I'm getting that this masculine could have had anger problems or maybe a little bipolar, a little bit. Like, hold on, Heavenly, and and like, wait, wait. This this person here, you feel this person up, and when they think about you, this person lights up. I'm telling you, like 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 some Christmas lights, like a Christmas tree. Okay, Christmas time. All right, like yeah, this person is just happy. This person is actually happy at the thought of coming in and loving you. Yeah, this person, y'all, this person, this person was non-committal. All right. They were a player. For some of them, they could have cheated on y'all. Or they abandoned you or they left you, cut you off cold, harshly. And this person received karma, heavy karma. Okay? Yeah, look. It says, I wish I could hold you. So this person is thinking about holding you, okay? But y'all, this person definitely could have received heavy karma for how they treated you in the past here. And and whatever karma this person went through, it could have made this person realize, like, who you truly are and how much you truly mean to them here, okay? Which is why this person, look, now they want a second chance here. Look, I connect with you at night. Didn't I say this person could be thinking about you all day, but at night is something significant about the nighttime. Like, this person think about you a lot at nighttime here. Look, I'm trying my best to forgive. This person had to forgive people in their past that hurt them because I feel like they were making you pay for things that people did to them in the past. Okay, hold on, Heavenly. Wait one second. I'm finna wrap this up because, baby, Heavenly calling. Look, you all have a past life together, and that's why this connection here was so strong because you all been together in many lifetimes here, okay? And this person might not have understood why this connection was so strong in the beginning, all right? It's just that this person seeing you 
as somebody that they could be with. They just wasn't ready to settle down, y'all. And like I said, some of the, for some of y'all, y'all, Divine Masculine treated you cold, okay? And whatever. And they want to come make it up to you here, okay? Look, I want to make it right, okay? So they finna come in and they gonna want to make it right with you, y'all, okay? But they want to honor you and they want to see you. So you're gonna be hearing from this person really, really soon, y'all, okay? But that's all I have for you all. I hope this resonated in some way and gave you all some type of clarity. And y'all... Um, follow my other my other channel. My new channel is called Unseen Secrets here, okay? And you can find my channel on my community uh page, y'all, okay? Because I shared a video, just click on it and then you can subscribe to it, okay? It got kind of a mixture of different things, not just twin flame, but mixture of things here, okay? But uh, yeah, that's all I got. God love you, and I do too. Bye.